farming in your bed? Once upon a time, farms were spread out as far as the eye could see. When cities were built, people stayed in high-rise apartments, really, really tall. Now, the farms got married to the tall buildings and it's called vertical farming. Ever slept in bunker beds? Now imagine bunker beds stacked one on top of another and another and another and instead of kids sleeping, fruits and vegetables would be grown in each bed. The world will soon face a food crisis. By 2050, the world's population will be 10 billion, 3 billion more than today. Just add 3 Indias to the world and imagine the population. Over 80% of the land usable to grow crops are already in use. So where will the extra land to grow food come from? I want more food items. But I already gave you everything. People still want more food. I should try vertical farming. Vertical farming has many advantages. Unused city areas can be used to grow food. You can grow food year round. Whether it's raining outside, sunny or snowing. Inside the vertical farm, the temperature remains the same. Since food is grown inside cities, no need to truck them to supermarkets from long distances, also known as environmental footprint. The further food comes from, the larger the footprint. Reduced use of chemical pesticides, as outside pests cannot enter a closed vertical farm, and less environmental damage, as the chemical residue is reduced. 80% of the world's fresh water is used by conventional farming. Vertical farming can use wastewater from taps leaving fresh water for drinking purposes. Each bed is watered, fed that is given nutrients by drip irrigation and uses just 2% of the water used by normal farming. Wow, the strawberries are so fresh and juicy. Spain, known for its holy with tomatoes, used to send tomatoes to all of Europe because their climate supported it. With vertical farming, Holland now makes more tomatoes than Spain even though their climate is not so good. Soon we in India will be able to grow foods all over the country that normally would not be possible in our climate. If you liked this video, share it with your Facebook friends and like the Bisbo page and subscribe to Bisbo's channel on YouTube so you will get to know whenever Bisbo posts a new story. Bye!